I'm Dave, this is the Cider Baby Pod. Uh, today we're in Biddeford and I'm speaking to White Raven Dan. Hello guys. Hi White. How are you doing? Good to see you. Well, this is a surprise. <laughs> it sure is. Uh, <laughs> I'm feeling very uncomfortable sat between you two guys. I'm very... We're not that bad. It's all good we? between no. friends. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, on that note, I think we'll end now. Um, <laughs> that, you've um, had this album, mate. I've, I've heard a little bit about it. Yeah, yeah, what have you heard? <laughs> you all good things, obviously. All there was things. a really good review, which I got. Th this man wrote it, and honestly, no, it's, no, no, no. it's the best review that I've ever read about any of our work, isn't it? And oh my god, Bill Swain, mate, thank you so much. You're freaking legend. legend. That's thank okay, you. the bill is in the post. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Yeah, it's fine. I've, I've moved. <laughs> <laughs> um, to be fair, it is a stellar album. I, like, like I say, it is the album of the year. I mean, have you been sitting on it too long or not long enough? Uh, well, sort of. Yeah. Sort of. <laughs> As you know, uh, it was released on the 8th of April. Yeah. Um, and then on something like the 7th of May, um, we become vocalist, uh, vocalist less. Yes. And that was a shock. Yes. Um, still in shock. <laughs> <laughs> um, I know, and uh, we, the three of us that were left over, we had to make some quick decisions. And, um, you know, we're standing by, by them now, which are oh, all now two months, two and a half months ago that we made some decisions. And um, so I'm now taking over lead vocals, but still playing lead guitar, rhythm guitar, being the only guitarist in the band. Yeah. I like to torture myself. <laughs> <laughs> um, oh, I've got so many answers to that. Yeah. Um, <laughs> to be fair, that is a brave move. Yeah. You must be cacking yourself. Shitting it. Honestly, it was the most scariest decision I've, I've ever made. Mm -hmm. uh, but I mean, the, I, I mean, you know, Luke and Tom were big time behind me. Um, Katie, my wife Jo, those are the people that are like, well if, if you don't give it a try, you know, you'll, you'll never know and you'll be kicking yourself if you don't give it a try. Um, but it was a hell of a lot to learn all at once. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm playing the, the riffs and things that what I do mm. and then having to take on vocal duties as well. It's tough. It is tough and I had to learn how to do that real quick and lyrics I still get, you know, some lines freaking, you know, messed up a little bit live, but, you know, I'm doing the very, very best I can. I don't know. That's it. You know, that's it. Yeah, just doing a banking job. Yeah. <laughs> uh, as, as, as an outsider. <laughs> <laughs> so, you're quite happy with him. Very happy with yeah. how it's going. Yeah, I mean, it's, although it's a hell of a lot to do, yeah. it's yeah. just balls deep, let's do it. Mm. And it's just works out brilliantly at the minute. Yeah, the, in fairness, the feedback has been really, really surpassed our expectations, I guess. Yeah. Um, so we're, we're really grateful for it. Yeah. Um, yeah, I must admit, I'm really enjoying it as well. I didn't, I didn't think I would enjoy being the sort of conduit between the band and the crowd as much as what I am. Uh, it, okay. It, 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 we've been fortunate uh, because the, the album was well received we ended up playing some, you know, we we played some good shows, mm. and there was a lot of people there. I mean, I was proper thrown in the deep end. Yeah. And yeah, I was freaking nervous before I mean, all all of them. Yeah, you know. <laughs> um, yeah. But it's been a hell of a lot of fun. I've really enjoyed the crowd interaction. You know, it's been great. Brilliant. Brilliant. I have had a good thing. So you must be doing a fairly good job of it. So, Thank you. So far. <laughs> well, yeah. There you go, obviously. It is, it is, and, and hopefully, you know, it can only get better, you know. Yeah. Do you think uh, it'll affect your writing uh, for the next album? Because it'll suit your vocal style more than... I think, I, I, obviously it's going it, to, you know, we, we, the plan is, is to stay as a three-piece. I do think uh, with a different voice, uh, it, will, it, will, it will, you know, we're going to write more to my voice, but our approach will be no different. Mm -hmm. Musically, we don't want to compromise yeah. on what no. we're doing because we're we've got a very specific sound. Yeah, and it's something we worked a lot on the sound. Yeah, so we want to keep the style, the riffs that we do, and the way we attack everything. We want to keep that the same. Yeah. So it's 
there's, there'll be a lot of working out to do as we go along. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Okay, so um, going back to the first album, is there anything you would have changed? Uh, what are the, when you say first album, do you mean... The, the current the one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 So, um, What's it called again? Sorry, I'm sorry. Don't shoot the messenger. Last right. time we spoke, we couldn't even say that. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to get all the titles out as I can. I was trying to get the title of the second single, and you wouldn't tell me. We were under lots of. Was it you said a cheeky smile? Uh, yeah. Yeah, something like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Thanks yeah. for that, guys. What was the second one? That was. Uh, well, I can't remember. Crush Pain. Yeah. yeah. Was it Masquerade yeah. we were talking about? Oh, that was the third. Yeah, 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 yeah it could yeah. have been Masquerade. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Thanks. Yeah. <laughs> well, you know, <laughs> off by heart now. <laughs> I refuse to play on the radio. Principal. <laughs> oh, <laughs> dear me, that hurt. It's honestly <laughs> that hurt. <laughs> Sorry, just, yeah. you know, no, no, that's no, fair enough. That's fair enough. No, no, fair no, enough. no, it's all good. Um, all right, then, so you've, you've, had, you've got the album, Don't Shoot the Messenger. Yep. Um, have you changed how you've approached some of the songs now? Gotta be honest, not really. No, no. So yeah, pretty good. Thing, or pretty sound. The yeah. only thing we changed is the tuning of our guitars, and that's because my vocal range was different to Will's. Mm. Uh, so we raised we, we raised our guitars up half a step. That is it. Everything else, there's been no compromise. There might be a slight different delivery in lines here and there, but I, I've, you know, I, I pers personally falls under live as well. Things are never exactly yeah, the same yeah, when they're yeah, live and it's yeah. all... And we think people that have you know really enjoyed the album and they want to come and see us live, they want to enjoy songs that they're familiar with. Yeah. You know, so we're not we're not changing arrangements, we're not rewriting stuff, it's uh, as is. Um, but it's just a little bit more delivered in, in my way than perhaps Will's way. But um, yeah, you'll recognise them all right. So. Good, oh, yeah. I'm glad about that. Um, well, you mentioned touring, oh, we might as well talk about it, we're in Biddeford tonight. Yes we are, yep, yeah. and then we're in... Um, uh, St. Austell Band Club tomorrow night. We've Deepest, got... darkest Cornwall. Yeah. <laughs> you may never come out at all. Honestly, I love Cornwall. Freaking mm. beautiful place. Oh, yeah. Really? You, you... Well, anywhere out of Essex is, <laughs> is better, to be honest. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it is. <laughs> oh, all right, fair enough. Yeah. So, what's, what's the plan after we go? Uh, St. Austell? Right, so we've got we've got got Sav Fest coming up in Leicester. We've got uh, we're at Leo's Red Line, we're supporting Mason Hill, aren't mm -hmm. we? Uh, we've got a Rock Witch Festival, uh, we've got uh, Billsley uh, Rock Club in Birmingham with the Riders Creed boys. Um, yeah, we've got a lot, got yep. a lot coming up. Um, then uh, hopefully, come sort of September time, we're going to take the foot off the gas a little bit and mm. uh, get in that rehearsal room and, and start knocking about some new tunes. So, um, I should look forward to that. Yes, yes. I mean, when they'll see the light of day, that's another question, <laughs> <laughs> but that's what you know. We to be because if you know, if we if we all hadn't left, then mm. we'd be you know, we'd be continuously touring. Yeah, um, because having just released the album, um, but we're getting asked a lot about. Oh, in fact, we played a show last week at the, uh, the Gifford in Wolverhampton, mm. and it was a freaking banging night, wasn't it? Absolutely brilliant, and. I mean, Tom, our drummer, he was asked six times, when's the next album? And you, you were no, asked, I was asked a lot, a few you? times, yeah. 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 I wasn't asked because they knew the reaction. They were like, <laughs> freaking well, it's fun! <laughs> <laughs> you know how expensive they are? <laughs> well, back in the day, they used to be at one a year. Oh, God, not anymore. Not, <laughs> <laughs> not with us. Not with us. Oh, yes. God. And we're, you know, it, it is going to be, it's going to be a bit adaptive and learning stuff. Um, for us as a band and mm. adjusting to a, the way a three piece, you know, it, mm. we've got some things we need to fathom out. Okay. Me in particular. Yeah. I mean, I am sort of bricking it by the end of the year because I did make a bold statement. You did, didn't you? <laughs> yeah, I did. Yeah. Have you, have you chosen it yet? I'm making sure that you are in the top five. <laughs> um, on the poll, <laughs> I'm paying people. I am pretty sure that you are not going to get. We won't, we won't get our number one. You will. Well, you won't. No. But if, number one. Yeah. You said. You said. Was it number one? Or, or no, I, I did say top five. I did say top the top five. five yeah. Right. Because okay. I knew there was a couple of strong albums out, which you know, people's course, choices. Yeah, you know, yeah. it's, it's, that's fair enough. But it's got to be in the top five, surely. 
It's not for us to say. Nobody wants to see me in a pink neo tie and tutu. Number six. <laughs> <laughs> You'll be safe. <laughs> <laughs> it could be. It could be really bad. Um, okay. Final question to both of you. Five favourite cheeses. Go. Cheese. Cheese. I'm dead. Oh, it's really oh, difficult. Come on. Cheese. Do you like a bit of rock fork? Mm hmm. Yeah. It's one of mine. Mm. Some raw. Mm -hmm. I've gone very French, really, haven't I? You have? Yeah. I'm not giving you any. You've got to be a stilton man. I do like stilton. I was yeah. going to say, you've got to be. Yeah. Yeah, that's, that's, that's my take. Some proper Rock cheddar. Pump. Some real cheddar. Yeah. Proper yeah, old proper mature. cheddar. Strong, yeah, yeah. Strong, extra mature. Mature, yeah. How many is that? Well, I'm going to say two. Jesus. Just to make <laughs> 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 Jesus, I like the pun. Um, Bell end cheese, does that count? If you want it. You can have it all you want to. I'm sure there's a nice cracker for it somewhere. <laughs> on that note, <laughs> on the high, I think we'll leave it to yeah. uh, these guys to perform tonight. A bit of a thank you very much, guys. No, thank, no, you, thank, thank you, thank you. Honestly, it's been a blast, and thank you so much for your support. And that really was the best review I've ever oh, no. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Bye -bye.